hello you are welcome back today i'll be sharing with you guys how i make this delicious coconut fried rice first we need to parboil our rice okay this part is very very important because you don't need to overcook your rice and you don't need to leave your rice uncooked okay so i just went ahead to parboil it you can see it's all well done here and I will go ahead to wash it and after washing it I will add some coconut water and I will go in with some chicken stock okay and it, here you don't need to add too much water remember this is a parboy rice you don't want to overcook this rice and you don't want the rice to be undercooked you can see the level of water just a little bit above the rice this is very very important okay when you are making any type of fried rice, okay, make sure your rice is not overcooked and is not undercooked. So I went ahead to add some salt and some pepper because I love spicy food. Okay, my food got to be spicy, baby. <laughs> All right. So at this time, I think the taste is okay. I will cover it to cook. Okay. And while cooking it, put your eyes on it. Okay. You can see I'm just giving it a, a small turn, just a very light turn to make sure that the rice is cooking evenly. Okay. We don't want it to cook on one side. You can see the, the rice are just single, 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 single there. Okay. At this point, the rice is all well cooked. Don't go anywhere, guys. If you're not following this page, I don't know what you're waiting for. And if you've not subscribed, I don't know what you're thinking at this point, okay? So, and I went ahead to get my coconut oil. Remember, this is a coconut fried rice. So, I went ahead to add some onions. I'll go ahead to fry it. And I went ahead to add some carrot okay because we are going to fry the car we are adding the carrot first because i don't want to have hot carrot when i'm eating okay i don't want it to be overcooked either okay and i went ahead to add my green peas or green beans <laughs> i went ahead to add some garlic okay i love garlic on my food i went ahead to add some nutmeg at this point this is when you add want to add all the um spices that you use your pepper okay i went ahead to add some salt some nutmeg some curry some you know i will list the list of all the things i added in the comment section or in the description box okay i went ahead to add my green pepper the green and the red bell pepper all right so this is the time to add all the things you want to add. Your pepper, okay? Just like I told you guys, I, I eat spicy food. My pepper is already in there, okay? I went ahead to add, finally, the green beans, okay? So that, you know, we are going to go ahead to fry these. I, I don't really like my veggies to be over fried. Either do I want them to be under fried, okay? So just fry normal, Okay? And at this time is fried. I'm going to go ahead to scoop some of it out because we don't want to, we don't want the pot to be congested. Some rice, we'll be adding them in section by section. Okay, section by section. All right, so that we'll fry them evenly. Okay, we don't want the pot to be congested. As you are adding the rice, if you want to add some veggies, you can add. Okay, so. That is just basically what this video is all about. Coconut fried rice. Okay, my family love this. Hala, your rice is done. Go ahead. And I went ahead to add some fried meat. Okay, this is a fried beef. I chopped them into small, into small chops. And I fried it. Okay, I went ahead to add it. And basically, your food is done. My family love this. They want to take this all the time. Because we love veggies. And hala. Go ahead and serve and enjoy with your loved ones. Don't forget to subscribe, follow us and share this video and leave us your comments in the comment section. I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.